when you think about an unregulated firm, you think about something like um, a McDonald's or a dry cleaners or any other sort of business. And when you when you think about how do they determine how much money they make, um, you start with your sales, how much, how many McDonald's hamburgers you sold, how many French fries, how many um, sodas. You subtract your expenses. That would be your labor expenses, your you know rent on the building, your electric and gas costs. And after you do both of that, you get your net revenues. Um, in order to determine how much profit that McDonald's made, for example, you would take your net revenues and you would divide it by your the dollars that you've invested. A regulated utility, on the other hand, is exactly backwards. We start with determining an authorized rate of return. So that's usually the part that seems the most complicated. How do you start with a rate of return? You're going to multiply that by the amount of money that the utility invests in the company and then add your annual expenses. So that would be your trucks, your labor, your benefits, um, your office expenses, your paper, your everything. And that gives us a term that we use, which is called revenue requirement.